people. Why should I start a YouTube channel? Bitch, why not? You have to find out what you like to do, find out what you can afford to do, and then just fucking you do it right now. You ain't got next. You got now. I met someone new last night and we kicked it and I'm going like that tonight. What's up, YouTube fam? It's your girl Trees back with another video. And as y'all can tell by the title, I'm coming on here to give some tips on how to or tips that I've learned on how to come back doing YouTube um become a youtube creator and the things that i use to start up with my youtube channel as y'all know i've been on youtube for a while but i've been stopping and going stopping and going so with that i lost subscribers i'm gaining new ones i lost watch time this that and the third so i decided to come on here to share some tips on what i've learned while doing my makeup because i haven't done my makeup in a long ass motherfucker day. that's one thing you gotta do don't curse so much jesus but i haven't done my makeup in a long time so i decided to talk to you guys while doing my makeup uh if you notice if you notice I changed my hair so this hair that I got on is not the same hair that I recorded in my last video because y'all could have told me that 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 looked like a chucky chucky wig y'all could have told me that and I would have been okay with that but anywho I really love this wig I haven't curled it yet I honestly just got it yesterday I'll put um I got off Amazon I'll put the lady store below and for the real OGs if you know you know I am shooting from my closet all my scrubs because you guys know I'm a nurse and then I try to get color coordinated behind me but yeah let's get started because I'm not here to hold y'all all day oh and happy Friday let's go so y'all know I'm blind <laughs> and I just took my glasses off so we're gonna see how well this shit work out so um first thing first I know people like should I start a YouTube channel? Why should I start a YouTube channel? Bitch, why not? Why not? Why not? It's easy money out here. Okay, I'm not going to say it's easy because you got to hit these thresholds. You got to have 1,000 subscribers. Um, Just to even... Okay, so to qualify... I haven't done my makeup in so long. I don't know where to start. I don't have many blemishes, so we're just going to go with it. Um, you got to have a thousand subscribers. To me, it wasn't that hard to have it because I started like three, maybe four years. No, I have to go back to when I post my first video. I started like three, four years ago, so it didn't take me long to get that. That's the easy part. The hard part is getting the watch hours. So you have to get like, am I, if I'm not, you have to get like 4,000 watch time, watch hours. That shit is the hardest. So you have to get engaged with your audience and get them to stay to watch your entire video. Like your entire video. So you have to be entertaining from the beginning to the end. And that's not always easy to do unless you're going on like an extravagant trip that most people can't afford to go on. So they're watching your entire video because they're going on. It's like them going on a trip. If that makes sense. Or are you doing like this um, vlog in a like an expensive house that nobody can afford. So they're watching that shit all the way through. Um, so that part to me was, is the hardest. So little backstory. I started my YouTube, like I said, a while ago. My first, my first video was me and my kids eating two-time noodles. That's when two-time for the two-time was the two-time. And, um... All I had was my iPhone and this was just a random thing because I wanted a YouTube channel. So I did that or what have you and uh, I just posted. I just posted. I didn't even fucking edit. I didn't do none of that shit. I didn't edit or anything like that and I just posted a video. It was fucked up quality. <laughs> but at the time I wasn't taking it serious. So and then I didn't know what I, I wanted to do. So yeah my thing is if you want to start start now fuck that uh i'm gonna start 2024 2024 that's my new year's resolution i hate that shit bitch start now start now why are you waiting to 2024 what's wrong with now start now so in 2024 you damn near there or you're 25 percent there so yeah why you need to start youtube why not? If you guys like to record to me, this is kind of like a project for myself because I'm doing a lot of transformation. So, boom. I came back. I'm coming back even strong, stronger. It's hard as fuck, but I'm here. Okay? All right. Take a uh, step. Not step. What I use to... um. What I use to record. What I use to start my video. So, 
all I had, like I said at the beginning, all I had was my iPhone. It wasn't even, it was a 10, honestly. I had my iPhone 10 and that's it. To start a YouTube video, all you got to do is create an account. It's fucking free and you just take off from there. You create an account, you take off from there and you just keep fucking going and you just record, you upload and things of that nature. So that's what I started with then. Now, as I continue to advance and progress, because the quality of your videos does matter, I have a SV1 Sony camera that my ex had, but then he was into YouTube too, and then he upgraded his camera. So, long story short, I have that. That's what I'm recording on now. I love the shit out this camera. If this camera breaks, I'm going to buy another one. Um, when I'm in public, if I don't feel like carrying a camera, I'll vlog off my phone. All I have is an iPhone 14, so it, it has good-ass quality. And and then I do have, I do have a ring light as well uh, that you can get for Amazon for really, really cheap. So you don't have to break the bank to fucking record a video. So please, when you first start off, you don't have to do all that. Let's not, let's not cap. A lot of people right now, you know, have great fucking views and they're vlogging off their phone. So don't break your pockets. A camera, your phone, good lighting, you're good to go. Um, inspiration. Find your thing. Is it, is, is that, e it's more easier said than done for me to tell you to find your fucking thing. Find your thing, find your niche, whatever they want to fucking call it. Find your thing. Um, like if you like to do fashion and you're, and you have the money to afford fashion, <laughs> don't be starting something that you can't really afford. So, what I started with was um, mukbangs, mukbangs, but at the same time, I'm not a really. I was, I was big. I was at the when I started, I was married, so my weight wasn't an issue for me per se because it's like, when well, you marry, you ain't gotta watch your motherfucking weight. So it's mukbang, mukbangs, or whatever. However, when you do those mukbangs and mukbangs, you gotta be mindful that you got to eat and you got to pay for shit that to eat. Then you gotta stay on top of the videos that's trending that's another thing you got to stay on top of the trending videos so if it's like the new kfc uh chicken you got to go buy the new kfc chicken and try it because that's what everybody want to know about they don't want to know about fucking uh okra <laughs> they don't want to know about the healthy shit that you eat people don't give two fucks about that so you have to one, you have to find out what you like to do, find out what you can afford to do, and then just fucking do it. Like I said, I started out doing mukbangs, but that wasn't my niche, niche, whatever y'all want to call it in the YouTube world. That wasn't my thing. So that failed. Then I tried to do uh, makeup tutorials. I love makeup, don't get me wrong, but I don't go a lot of places where I need to wear makeup. <laughs> you know what I mean? I work as a nurse. I don't wear makeup. Uh, I do wear makeup if I'm going like out with friends or what have you, but I haven't put makeup on in a hot ass minute. That's why I decided to do makeup for this video. It's not a makeup video. It's to help my newbies out because I'm still a newbie myself, which lead me to the next one. <laughs> my next one is, okay okay pay attention it's okay to watch the, the 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 high um the established youtubers because you could get inspiration from them however i i love Aaliyah's face i love peyton charles i love kyra i love all of them but the more i start to watch them more than the people that's on my level with subscribers right now the more i aim to be like them which is not realistic at this point them girls are going out the country them girls are doing their big one i'm not at the position right i'm not in a position right now to do my big one you feel me like I'm not there yet <laughs> and I'm okay I'm okay with not being there yet like I'm not in that position so I like uh it's this girl a a week a weekly a weekly I'll put her thing up I love watching her she has 12k subscribers I only have like five to six k subscribers or what have you but I'm watching her because I can learn from her to see how she's getting more engagement because she's doing realistic shit like she only posts on the weekend because she has a regular job I can relate I have a regular job the higher ups they don't have a regular job YouTube is their regular job so watching her helps me know like okay it's okay to do indoor content 
it's okay what indoor content she doing am i okay with doing that can i do content just recleaning my whole house or redecorating or doing fall decor and da -da 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 and, da -da -da and da -da -da. when you're looking up you when you're looking for content you look at what's going on what are people subscribing to what are people watching then you go off you take off with that okay if they're watching oh jamaica trips and you ain't got it don't don't you try to make that shit happen that's what the big ones doing because they can afford that the little ones like myself like myself we ain't doing all that i'm doing indoor content right now because one my kids are at school two i'm off work today three boom it ain't no good weather all right so watch people give the little people more of a chance that's on your level and you can learn from it next another one that can help with new youtubers is do your research okay do your research it's okay let me let you out some it's okay to um go online go on youtube youtube is here to help you i just fucking learned that shit it tells you when a mother when a person is watching your shit how often they're watching your shit when the best time to post your shit like the best time for me to post my videos are at 3 p.m so i posted one video i dropped that video at 3 p.m on wednesday this video i may drop at 3 p.m tomorrow or 3 p.m monday because today's friday so map your shit out like i watch so many um i watch so many uh youtube uh tips to tell me like how can like they're trying to fucking help me so i take that shit and i run with it you feel me like you do your research look up some shit see how other people are like other successful people are getting it done like i'm not there yet but i'm going to get there and always be positive about your shit like i just said i'm not there but guess what i'm gonna get there you can't tell me i'm not because guess what i'm i'm back i knew i took a big l by uh disappearing i knew i took a big l so I took that big L and I'm going to make it a big W. I'm going to make it a fucking win. I'm not embarrassed to come back and just be like, yeah, I went from having 2K. I went from having 2K views, likes and shit to now I'm barely getting 20 views. You know what I mean? Like it is what it is. It is what it is. I'm not ashamed. And that's something you guys have to... Don't be ashamed to want different. If you don't start now, guess what? You're going to be in the same motherfucking situation you were in this year. Next year, you're going to be in the same situation. And then you're going to be looking at other people YouTube and be like, damn, I should have fucking started that shit. And you should. You should have. But you didn't. So, do your research. Figure out what the fuck you need to do and do it. I, I got, like, brush hair on my nose. So, that is a good tip as well. Uh, one more big one. Big one. Big one that I had to learn was... Consistency! I'm still not there. <laughs> I'm still not there with consistency. So, what I mean by that is... Uh, pick, pick something that works for you. So, what I mean by that is... What I mean by that is... If I could post every day, I know that would help me out a lot, but I can't. I can't post every day. I work. I am a mother of three. No, it don't look like it, but I am a mother of three. So, and I work for a living. Um, so, I can't, I personally can't post every day. So, like I said, the girl that I watch that's more on my level, uh, that's a worker, and she's, her subscriber count is going up. And things of that nature, she works. So her her vlogs are the weekend in my life. She only posts on the weekend. She has a job where she's off every weekend. So her she her consistency is I post every weekend. Every weekend. That's consistency. You don't have to post every day. You don't have to do that shit. Post every weekend, post every Monday, post every Wednesday, every Sunday, whatever, whatever it takes. I learned that the motherfucking hard way. So yeah, my consistency is. Uh, I want to, and I'm still, I'm still figuring it out. I want to be able to post every Wednesday and every Monday, Monday, every Wednesday. Okay. So I'm off 
the okay because my schedule changed i alter my schedule to pursue this so like this video may go up monday at three and then my next video that i can record on monday may go up wednesday at three so it's going to be something like that i'm still not quite 100 percent sure like how i'm going to do that but i'm gonna figure it out right now i started with this every monday i don't i can't even see am i focused i started out every monday with this posting so figure out your shit figure out your shit and then stick to it and then post your videos if your videos is just chilling at home bitch post that shit guys post that shit so be consistent be consistent all right and my my other last and final tip as a revamp youtuber or what have you write your shit down like don't overthink it don't do something for someone else just write that shit down know what you want to do like i write everything down i pray about it I, I got really heavy in my praying so i pray about my shit and i just fucking i write it down honestly i get ideas from the inner voice in my head if my voice says um if my voice says hey you should do um a video on your journey i'm like all right let me run with it i get up i write it down because my days get a little hectic where I will forget that inner voice idea. Uh, one big thing that I'm going to tell you. One big thing I'm going to fucking tell you that I learned from doing my research. So you don't have to do this research. I'm about to give you the tea right now. I'm about to give you the tea right now. Do a lot of how-to videos. What do people go on YouTube for to figure out how to do something? Did you catch that? One more time. Do a lot of how-to videos. Because what do a lot of TikTokers... I mean, what do a lot of people go on YouTube for? To figure out how to do something. Now, don't be on there talking about how to build a house and you don't know what the fuck you're doing. I'm on here about how to start your YouTube. How to start off. how Because I'm starting off. It's some shit I can fucking relate to. You feel me? You feel me? Do shit like that. Do that type of content so people can relate and people can fucking understand. Do you hear me? Do you feel me? One more time. Do a lot of how-to videos because why do people come on YouTube to find out how to? You got it? Okay, you got it. So let's finish this up here because like I said, I'm not trying to keep you guys long. I just wanted to do my makeup. I wasn't really focused, but I'm going to go in with this brown lip real quick and then i'm going to go in with this club hopper nyx lip liner and then we're going to wrap this motherfucking video up because i got shit to do <laughs> no i really don't i gotta um cook for my kids and what have you and then i have been on my weight loss shit when i tell you when i tell you that i have been changing my whole mindset my whole i am um, the way I move and I only do it for me. The last time I was, this is what Club Hopper looked like. The last time I lost weight, I did it for a challenge. This time I lose weight, I do it for me. And people are like, you're losing your booty. I don't care about that. I don't care about that. My man, whoever comes to my life and when I put a ring on it, it's not going to want me just because of my booty. Okay, so let's put on this lipstick. Let's fix this hair and let's see the end results. Okay? Okay, be right back. All right, y'all, this is the end result. Not too bad for me not to have done my makeup in a while. Now I'm thinking I should have did some motherfucking baby hairs, but I still can. I still can do baby hairs. Let's go in a different light. Okay, though. so this is the end result of the little light, little light beat. Little light beat. Oh, the girl I was telling y'all about, here she is right here. Let me zoom in. How you zoom in? That's her right there. It's not the best photo of her out that I follow that's more so like on my level when it comes to being creative content creator or whatever. So yeah, those are the tips that I have for you to start your YouTube channel. Again, you don't have to have everything. You can use your phone. Just don't use an Android because we know how that go. But you could just use your iPhone um, and just record. 
just hit the record button don't look at the video don't critique yourself don't look at the way you look and be like i don't like it because my hair fucked up baby if you go back some to some of those videos that i post i look fucked up my last video matter of fact my last video i was on there <laughs> i was on there with my real hair out so and i recorded and I record, I just hit the record button. I put it out there, it was a Sunday. I didn't have much time in the world to freaking record, but I record that shit and I put it out there. That's all you have to do. That's it, okay? So don't make it a 2024 goal, make it a now goal. Right now, fuck next, you got right now. You ain't got next, you got so, now. Hit the record button, come on, join the fam. And we can all link up together, we're all newbies again. So you never know. You just never know. Your video may take off and you may surpass me. But I'm the type of friend that's going to cheer you on and tell you, bitch, drop the gems. Drop the gems. Let me know. Let me know. Okay. So yeah, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Hit the record button and just take off. And don't be ashamed to live your dreams because guess what? You working for somebody else that live their dreams. You clocking in for somebody else's job. You clocking in at McDonald's, Portillo's. You're not related to them. So what does it matter at this point? Hit the record and hit the subscribe button and join the family. <laughs> all right, y'all. That's it. That's all. It's been fun. Thank you for watching. For those who have watched, make sure, again, to join the family. All you got to do is hit that subscribe button, like, comment, if you shall please, and get started. That's all I got for you. I was almost done with uh i was about to start cooking and then i cut this damn camera back on because baby it looks so much better with baby hairs y'all motherfuckers could have told me that yeah it looks so much better with baby hair so yeah <laughs> baby hair yeah yeah now i want to do the whole video over but i can't fuck fuck